friends, welcome to Wellness Talks where it's all about your health in your hands and stay healthy, stay happy. Today we are going to talk about health and food. We have with us our super chef Sandeep who has curated some lovely recipes for the group and he is also a chef at Wits Hotels. Welcome Sandeep to Wellness Talks. So I want to know from you Sandeep, when you talk of healthy food, what are the healthy methods of cooking food? Believe me, in today's world, uh, we are not eating what our ancestor used to eat, where the food used to come from the field and with, and uh, it could be turned out into a final product with, with minimum time and temperature. Today's world, we are eating more of the food which is fried, <coughs> microwaved, or pressure cooker, in which all the nutrition value is lost. And uh, so I would recommend people to have uh, more of the food products like poached, uh, grilled, uh, barbecued, those things where all the nutrition values are intact and the consumption of oil is minimum which is very important for our health. So I would recommend people to use air fryer where uh, uh, you can have uh, more of the fried foods like uh, which, you, which need not to put in the oil. So the consumption of oil is minimum. Think of deep fried food as a sponge that's going to absorb a lot of oil which is going to lead to many many health problems. So the best way suggested by Sandeep is to either boil the vegetables or saute the vegetables or use an air fryer which is just the wonderful ways of cooking. So Sandeep, does it mean if I boil my vegetables or air fry them or steam them, I will lose my taste? Definitely not. Boiling or air frying does not uh, lose the taste at all. But uh, in, instead of boiling, I would emphasize more on blanching. Blanching means putting vegetables into water and when it's 50% cooked, you need to remove it. Now you need to do that wisely. We need to select our vegetables, for example, carrots, which are a little harder. Mm -hmm. You need to blanch them as well as zucchini or broccoli is considered. Those are tender vegetables, which need, does not need blanching. So the, those things you can directly put on the griller or on the barbecue or saute that will give uh, more nutrition value and taste uh, also increases. So taste be, health be. Wonderful, I think that's the Vruti adjunct which we always say that health be and taste be. So more what you want to say is that uh, vegetables or stuff that has more water content, you may not blanch, but stuff which is harder, you blanch to make it a little soft and tender and then cook it again or grill it again to give it a better taste so that nutrition as well as taste both is retained, right? Absolutely, absolutely. Wonderful. But I often see people, you know, uh, associate health food with uh, loss of taste or food that is very boring. You know, if you serve, uh, say, healthy food, I'm sure kids are just going to squirm and say that we don't want to eat that. So today, since you are, you are here, I want you to give us quick healthy recipes that mothers can make in a jiffy even if there is some guest at home or whether it is a tuffin food, it just cooks fast. In the morning, uh, children are quite bored of eating uh, oats. So I will replace the oat into a masala uttapam where your oats are soaked in uh, water for a few minutes and it's churned, churned up and then the basic process which we follow for masala uttapam is your onion, tomato, capsicum, top it with those and your masala oats uttapam is ready. Another for the guests, if they are, I would recommend uh, them to have uh, dahi or adrak ke kebab. That is your curd, your cottage cheese, your pasin, which is there in the uh, every household. You can combine those, combine into a tiki and then grill it. Again, I'm saying about grilling, not frying. So you can grill it, that again the nutrition value is intact. And as far as leftover things are concerned, we need not to throw things. We have the chapatis in our home. You can uh, cut all the vegetables, combine it, give a stir fry to it, fold it into a chapati and grill it. Those are the casadillas, which is a Mexican delight. Wonderful, Sandeep. These are some awesome recipes and I'm sure our viewers have really taken home some wonderful tips from you in terms of how they can retain nutrients, how they can, you know, use their leftover food and how they can in a jiffy prepare, uh, you know, masala uttapam, which is really great. Thank you so much for being with us. So this is all from me, Dr. Bhavi Modi. Stay healthy, stay happy because it's your health in your hands. Thank you. So 
If you have liked the video, share, like and subscribe to our channel Wellness Talks. Thank you.